just want to make a little video here showing the benefits of Windows 8 especially if you're using multiple monitors so I have two monitors here and I have on Windows 7 if you had multiple monitors when you went down to the window start screen right here and you clicked it you got your programs right your little your standard fly out menu on Windows 8 I can just roll the mouse wheel this is I'm not using a tablet I'm using a monitor multiple monitors but what's great about Windows 8 there's a couple things I'll start right with the basic thing you can arrange these tiles any way you want to imagine picture them as being the icons on your desktop the shortcuts but instead of just shortcuts you have actual little um, customization groups that you can group them in so if you decide if you right click the desktop and choose customize you can actually relabel these groups so I call editing apps games and pictures office apps stuff like that calculator office stuff you can rename them so you can organize them better and get to them quicker so before in the past I would have to launch the start go to scroll down find my Adobe Premiere now it's right here Adobe Premiere but say I'm looking for an app that I don't know where it is say Nero and I go, I go in here and I'm like where's my Nero where's my Nero all these apps well you can go you can sort by date installed by most used by category or by name and the fastest thing to do is to search over here just type N-E-R there's Nero Nero Rico Nero Disk Speed there's my Nero apps um, out Outlook there's Outlook now say I launch Outlook Outlook launches here let's say I take and move Outlook like a lot of times you just grab it move it over to your other monitor the cool part the other part that I was telling you is say I'm working in Premiere here and I come over here to this to the other window on Windows 8 Windows 7 you just had the taskbar but on Windows 8 you get the Windows monitor no matter where you are so if I'm over here I can launch something else directly from I can go to File Explorer and go right to File Explorer here. I can close it. I can go over here and click this. I can go to File Explorer here. It'll bring it back over there. It's much faster to get to the apps. If I wanted to launch, go here and launch Adobe Encore, I can click it right there without closing Premiere like before on Windows 7. On Windows 7, it was much more difficult to get to an app, and it took a lot longer to get to the apps than it did than it does on Windows 8. I find Windows 8 a whole lot easier and a whole lot faster to get to my applications and to get the, get the things in a hurry especially when I'm using when I'm using uh, multiple monitors because your start things there your desktop there everything is in the same everything's on the same on both monitors you get your your little pop out fly outs it's on both sides so if I'm over on this monitor and I click it there's my things and I go over to the side and there's my charms exact same thing on both monitors it doesn't give you one monitor or the other on Windows 8.1 at least so if I'm over here I can do a search for just VL there's VLC media player boom um, Nero, Nero Recode. Click that. Here's Nero Recode. Launches on my other monitor. Drag it over here. Close it over here. Now if I go back to the start again, same difference. I actually put it right here on the start. So there it is right there. It's even faster for me to get to and it launches back on this other monitor. For multi-monitors, it's a, th it's a lot better. And since getting used to... Uh, since getting used to it I find it... I got it on my laptop and I started getting used to it on it. On it and now that I have it on my on my desktop with multiple monitors I can't I could never imagine going back to Windows 7 after using Windows 8 especially for multiple multiple monitor use